We've got a whole summer of Pixar Fest and there's a whole bunch of food and treats to try. Here's some of what we tasted so far. Okay, starting off strong, we've got the Luigi and Guido cone. This is surprisingly decent. The panko crumble on top is really garlicky and it's super good. I will say the cones in general still aren't that great and the pasta was a little overcooked. All right, the huarache is new this year and it was fine. It comes with rice and beans. It's got carne asada, guacamole, cheese, salsa, lettuce. And then for dessert, you can top it off with a street style watermelon. It's got lime juice, chamoy, tahin. For $6.99, I would say skip. For some reason, Pixar Fest has a lot of big potatoes. This is the barbecue potato dog from Refreshment Corner. It's pretty good. All right, now we've got the Dinoco Blue Cheeseburger. And this one was surprising. It still has that weird mushroom and beef patty, but there's a lot of fun stuff going on here. It's got a blueberry compo, blue cheese, red onion, arugula, 11 aioli, and it comes with steak fries. But the piston cup is probably going to go to this little cutie right here. It looks like a white wall tire, but it's a chocolate cake with a red cheese cake filling and a chocolate glaze. Okay, no, actually, this is our favorite thing. This is so cute. This is pistachio ice cream with a white chocolate cover and some decorations on top. It is so good, but so cute. Shake 2319 has got a tropical vibe. It's pretty good. And then I wish I could say this takes the cake, but it's just a vanilla cake. It's fine. Pixar Fest lasts until August 24th, and don't forget to like and follow for more mouse info.